Thank you. I like your encouragement. <sighs> Woo! Yeah. Good morning, Red Brains. Welcome back to another Mail Time episode, episode 23, featuring the lovely Miss Bird. <laughs> Got a pretty standard episode for you today. Three packages, all of them from the United States. Two from New York, one from Tejas. Which one should we go with first? Let's do Tony from New York. Do not cut this package. Sorry, bro. I'm gonna have to just finger it. Oh, come on. Come on, Tyson. Hopefully that joke is still funny some other time. I can totally cut it. I don't listen to authority. <gasps> I can see right through it. I want, I want you to like show my reaction to you cutting it. Like, I just want to see it myself. Can you show me? Because I feel like it was complete and utter shock and disgust. I could see right through it. I could see the writing on the other <gasps> side. <gasps> I repeated it for you. Replay. <gasps> <laughs> that was a close one. That that little tape job came off. That's so funny. Yeah, they did. Okay, here you go. All right. <clears throat> oh boy. Well, this is handwritten, so I apologize if I stumble a little bit. Dear Bike and Bird and soon to be Miss Bird. Mrs. Bird, sorry. I hope these found their way to you fine. Also, greetings from the United States Military Academy. Hell yes, yeah, sir. Thank you for your service and being a badass and shit. Your videos definitely help get me through some of the more monotonous days here. I just wanted to thank you for giving me the motivation to go through with getting my bike and starting my own motovlog, Stars and Pipes. Dope ass name. That's awesome. Dope ass name. Stars and pipes. Also, big thanks for helping me get back on track searching for heel toe shifters for my 883 iron. I'll figure the internet out someday. <laughs> that Google thing, man, that Google.com, it's freaking dope. <laughs> Congratulations to you and Miss Bird on your engagement. Pending when you actually put out the videos that include this package, I will also hopefully be engaged soon. As a small token of my appreciation, I've enclosed a decal of the USMA Shield logo and two poker chips from the shop I bought my bike at. You two can fight over who gets which one. <laughs> keep up the good work and keep doing you, amigo. Respectfully, Tony. <laughs> right where he had the, the the chips taped down, he said, these SOBs ain't going nowhere with a smiley face with sunglasses on. Shades. But it's funny because when I opened the envelope, this one, one was, was off. off. It was off uh -oh. of there. He was just, he went somewhere, right? Oh, man, Tony, that is awesome. Yeah, man, those heel toe shifters, man, there. Oh, you know what? Let's do this first. Doing the decal first. Whoop. Oh, no. Cut to close up. We've got a uh, what appears to be a Spartan shield and a sword. Uh, I believe he said this was the United States Military Academy um, mm -hmm. logo, USMA. So I love decals, guys. So if you want to send those in, I also will appreciate that as well. Whoopa. Cut to close up. We have two chips. We have a black and white as well as a blood red and black chip. On the bar and shield side, we have New Burr, New York, www.fasthog.com. On the back side, we have Maroney's, Harley Davidson, with the bar and shield and some flames. So, which one would you like? Because I will tell you right now, I am cool with either. I am too, so. I got to pick on the last episode, like, three of mine, so. Yeah. I'll take the black. Just because yeah. I got pink right above it, so. Cool. Thank you, Tony. Once again, thank you for your service, and uh, thank you for all your... You're doing. Um, I'm glad I could help you. You know, type into that Google machine. <laughs> <laughs> it's a hard thing to work, you know. It's sometimes it can be, especially when looking for Harley parts. So, what we got next? This one is from Mike. Mike, 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 Mike. From New York. Ooh, another New York. From Long Island. Uh, Long Island. Long Island, New York. You can cut this one. You can Ooh. see through. Also, guys, I don't know if you noticed it, but I'm starting to write dates on the back of these because it helps me keep them in order. And just to let you know uh, how much of a delay that we're on, um, we're on 2-9. And this episode's coming out at uh, March 27th. So, 
Next episode, we're going to start doing four per episode. So please keep up the uh, the rate. I'm sorry, not four per episode. Yes, four per episode. Four per episode. Next, we already started doing three per episode. So we're going to start doing four per episode if we have them. So just got to keep them coming, guys. Keep them chips on coming. Keep it rolling. Yeah, baby, get it. All right, on to Mike's package. I can see right through this bitch, so I'm cutting. <laughs> nope, knife still has not been sharpened. Please hold. <laughs> I mean. Another handwritten letter? You New Yorkers like to write. New York. <clears throat> Dear Bike and Bird and Mrs. Bird, here are a few chips to add to your collection. Hope you don't have these yet. I just started writing last year and your channel was a big influence. My first bike was a Honda C630... 6300F? I'm sorry, I don't know the, the Hondas as well. Oh no, sorry. CB300F. Duh. And I just purchased a Sportster 883 2006. After watching you and Blockhead, I knew I wanted one. Thank you for all the informative videos and builds. I appreciate your honesty about how products perform. Keep up the great work. Be blessed, Mike. Thank you, Mike. I've had a lot of people call me out lately saying like, oh, all you do is, is get sponsors now. You're probably getting, getting paid to say something. My sponsors, okay, especially when they get lowered, they don't tell me, hey, review this. I ask them, hey, I would like this part, and they say, sure, we need some reviews on it. Boom. Like, I'm, I'm still re asking for, for what I'm, they're not just sending me out stuff and I'm reviewing it, so like, I'm, I ask for it first. Sorry, tangent, sorry. I, I think that the real point is that you give an honest review, not just that you, because yeah. even if they did send you something you didn't ask for, you're still. It's still gonna be an honest review. Honest. And a lot of, a lot of people, Especially, I'm, I'm gonna play to the Harley stereotype. A lot of Harley riders will try to justify their purchase. For example, me and Ken were on online earlier, and we found a Harley Davidson motorcycle air dryer for like 200 and something bucks. It's a freaking leaf blower with the bar and shield on it, and like there was like a bunch of five star reviews. I'm like, it's a leaf blower. So I feel like people were just trying to justify their purchases and writing five star reviews. But, yeah, sorry, I'm. Okay. <laughs> Cut to close up. We have a white and red chip on the bar and shield side. We have Riverhead, New York with a phone number. On the uh, back side, we have Eastern Harley Davidson with the bar and shield and some flames. Next. Cut to close up. We have a black and orange chip. We have on the bar and shield side, Riverhead, New York on the. Oh, okay. They're all, the same. all three of these are the same. So we also <laughs> have a uh, we have a black and orange with the same graphics front and back, and we have a yellow and black with the same graphics front and back. I'm assuming one of these is for you, and then two are for me. Which one would you? Like? I wouldn't assume that because they're all different colors. Yeah, but they're the same graphics. So. But it is it is going to be nice because I kind of like that they'll all be sitting next to each other on the board, and they're the same because you'll know that those all came from the same place. It's kind of cool. So you don't want one, is what you're saying? No, I mean, obviously I love getting crisps, but we could put them all together. They did not indicate, and that's fine. Well, Mike, if one of these is supposed to be for her, let me know. Uh, if not, all three of them are going to be going together for the time <laughs> being. I like them like that. I like it like that. She like that. Hey, you said Hey, okay. Next! This is from brother-in-law in Baytown, Texas. Oh, I guess that's from your brother-in-law because yeah. he lives in Baytown. <laughs> yeah, this is from my brother-in-law. He, uh, mm -hmm. he recently got his Harley, finally. He's been talking about a Harley since I was still in probably either middle school or high school. And uh, he actually, he's from Baytown, which is near Houston, and he actually picked one up in the Hurricane Harvey flood auctions for a hell of a price and uh, he spent the last couple months getting it back to roadworthy and hopefully you'll see him on the channel either pretty soon if you haven't already and i know he's coming down soon yeah i don't, I don't you know about that one the surgeon it 
<laughs> That's oh, funny. Boy. He has excellent handwriting. Yeah, I mean, it's very... <laughs> um, Straight and liney. Straight and liney. Yeah. All right. He writes, Dear kinfolk, first off, congratulations on finally pulling the trigger and putting the R in Miss Bikenbird's title. Your sister and I cannot wait for the wedding festivities. Who sent y'all were invited? I'm just kidding. <laughs> Second, my hat is off to you both for creating a fun and entertaining channel. I look forward to riding with you guys on spring break, and hopefully we can make it to a rally or two as well. I also look forward to meeting the OG crew that do their part to make the channel great. I'm strangely craving hot wings now. <laughs> Lastly, I have enclosed for you four of the cheapest souvenirs you can purchase from Harley Davidson. There are two for each of you. Let her pick the one she wants. Happy wife, happy life. Keep up the great work. Keep having fun together. Ride safe, and I'll see you guys soon. Sincerely, your brother-in-law. P.S. Printer was out of ink. I think you your handwriting is better than most printers, so <laughs> I'm totally okay with that. <laughs> and I've never met him before, because last time your sister came. It was just my sister, yeah. Just your sister. I said his job friends. requires him weird hours, yeah. stuff like that, so it's it's hard for him to make those kinds of things. So. Let's see. Him with chips. Cut to close up. We got two chips here. We have a lime green and black, as well as a electric blue and black. On the bar and shield side, we have Pasadena, Texas, Pasa, Get Down, Dina. <laughs> On the back side, we have San Jacinto Harley Davidson. This was the dealership we wanted to stop at. I'm sorry. You, I said, get down, Dina. Yeah, I don't know if that refers to like dancing, like get down, or like, because Pasadena's not known as like the best city. <laughs> so I don't know if they're like, get, get down. down. <laughs> like, but uh, this was actually the dealership we wanted to go to when we went to Houston. Remember when we took that, we went across that big giant bridge, and we're like, oh, San Jacinto Harley-Davidson's up here. Let's stop. Oh, and it was a Sunday, yeah, and they were closed. Yeah, 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 I remember. Member to member. I remember. Which one would you like, green or blue? I want the green one. Of course you do. You want the green one? No, nah, it's fine. It's a different blue. Well, if you give me that yellow one, then they won't be right underneath. There you go. How'd you call me out of that one? <laughs> Problem solved. <laughs> All right, next. Super. Cut to close up. Once again, uh, two of the same chips. On the Barn Shield side, we have the 115 year anniversary, uh, Pasadena, Texas. On the other side, we have a San Jacinto Harley Davidson with, uh, wait, this is a full color chip. <laughs> so uh, I would highly request that you take the blue one because I have a blue one all about this one. On the. Um, yes, I will take the blue one. Okay. I can't wait for you to edit that because you're like, on the bu bu bu. It's cracking me up. All right, well, thank you, brother in law. I hope to see you soon. It's been a hot minute since I've seen him. God, it's been a hot minute. It was before we were dating. It's the last time I went and saw him. Wow. 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 All right, guys, that's going to do it for today's packages. Before we cut out, I'm going to go ahead and cut to close-up of what we have so far. So if you have a chip that uh, you don't see up on the board, or if you have any other fan mail that you want to send in, go ahead and send it here to the address on the screen. So that is it for today's episode. Thank you to everyone who sent in stuff for today and providing today's content. But other than that, if you like this video, go ahead and hit that like button. If you haven't already, go ahead and... Punch that subscribe button. And as always, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.